You ready for the heat today? Oh, I'm ready. You ready to sweat bullets? Are you ready? Oh yeah. I think so, you might have to shave that hair off. It's looking that that's gonna be no, a little man. hot. You know what else I'm excited for? When we get to Cabo, I'm gonna get this thing braided. I know you see you've this mop. You've been talking it's gonna about go, that. Click, 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 click. <laughs> <laughs> my hair will be consistent with my iPod. A little bit of black flavor. <laughs> Professional motorcycle riders, best friends, and Baja champions. Kendall Norman and Quinn Cody are on a 12-day dirt bike adventure. They set off from California for the Baja with just a bike, a pair of trunks, and some flip-flops. Today, they're in La Paz and will be riding to Land's End, Cabo San Lucas, the halfway point of their mission called Chasing Summer. I don't know, the club's just still going on in my head right now. There in a bit. Phew! It's hot, let's get moving. The backwoods trails between La Paz and Cabo are lush, soft, and super fun. Today, Kendall and Quinn have recruited a couple of La Paz locals to lead the ride. Arturo and Ramon are gonna lead us down to uh, Cabo today. The locals, uh, have some really good trails around here, and so we. Uh, Dude, yeah, this we let them kind of take V Trail Boss for this section. Yeah, we learn all kinds of new trails. So yeah. we're just gonna go with the flow, no navigation. Let our turtle show us all the uh, all the good stuff. Bahia de los Sueños, the English translation is Bay of Dreams. Located 35 miles south of La Paz, this exclusive beachfront community includes the Train Stop Restaurant, a unique upscale hangout with cold drinks and fresh food. Little, little piece of paradise. One of the nicest places I've ever seen in Baja, for sure. This is nuts in the middle of nowhere in Baja. This guy has a full train set. Slot car track, a bar downstairs. I mean, I, I really don't want to leave, honestly. I feel, I feel, I feel good. And it tastes even better. The hat is still on the head. All right, bright day of dreams, until next time. when you just about hit a cow. <laughs> the East Cape of Baja is extremely hot and humid during the summer. Thus, the boys made a quick stop in Las Barreras for a much needed cold drink. This stretch along the East Cape is without a doubt the most beautiful coastline ride in Baja. The sun was now setting on the seventh day of this mission and the boys have now ridden almost 1,400 miles. As night falls, they were closing in on the trip's halfway point of Cabo San Lucas. Riding a dirt bike the entire length of the Baja is no small feat. The crew was stoked to have reached Land's End. Now it was time for cheap beer and bad tequila. Take a little 
little spin out to the to the land's end, man. We made it! Land's end! Kendall's been uh, talking about getting his hair braided for this whole trip. It's only been growing for eight months. We're gonna go ahead and uh, see if we can find a little girl to uh, give him some braids. I've been saving it for this one moment. your mind like Mike Dunn lost his grind see I'm a boss with mine there's no need to floss with mine getting older I ain't lost my prime got my swagger back fuck you niggas that put that game back I put the gauge where your abdomen at you where the battling that these young niggas with these babbling raps they be out there tattling facts they in four minutes we gotta, you believe this guy? Of, we gotta bust one hell of a move and get back to La Paz. It's like 3.30 and we gotta move. We've had a hell of a good a good stop here at Land's End, but man, the halfway trip at this point has uh, come to an end and now we gotta start making a move towards the finish. Dazed, confused, hungover, and braided, the boys now had to pull it back together and finish this ride. Their truck was 1,200 miles north in Ensenada, and it would take them five more days to reach this final destination. It was after 4 p.m., and Kendall and Quinn were now back to work, and once again, riding into the night. All I know right now is I'm super tired and my hair's braided. I mean, new look, you know. 